Michael Emanuel. Man, this middle linebacker group is still not solidified, in my opinion. Good pickup and great name, but it feels like the Miles Jack signing. Thoughts? Miles Jack was a dope player until he got hurt. Thoughts? Miles Jack was on page that had 200 tackles here before he got hurt. The growing, remember? Thoughts? Where we at, man? How you feel about that? To me. Uh, I was the big man. fan of the Miles Jack signing. It was just the growing pandemic. That changes a lot, man. When dudes get hurt, their game can be negatively affected by it, man. That was the only reason why Miles Jack didn't work out long term here. If he stays healthy, man, we're not even tripping about any of this. But when you get hurt, along with being the highest paid dude on our team at that position, right, inside linebacker, that can't, you know, it just doesn't look good. And then I'm sure at some point they asked him, do you want to take the pay cut? He probably says no. And then that's what we did. We did in terms of, you know, moving him from the roster and stuff like that. But in terms of his production, when he was healthy, he was actually balling for us, man. He just got the growing stuff, man. And yeah, you can't get hurt, man. Getting hurt kills you. Yeah, I thought that was a great signing yeah. last year. I was probably more pumped about the Miles Jack signing than I am for Daquan signing. Yeah, I mean, shoot, I was more happy I'm about pumped it. about both, but like Miles, Miles Jack, Jack, you knew exactly on, what you're bro. getting. He's going to be our best linebacker. Absolutely. It literally was when the growing happened was at seven, week seven, week eight, whenever that was, like mid season point, And it just lingered and lingered and lingered to the point where, didn't he miss a game? I want to say he missed some time too. But it was definitely yeah, a point where. Yeah, those last like four or five games, yeah, it was iffy. Right. It was points where I know for a fact people are talking about it at practice like, yo, this dude is barely walking around out here. You talking about going here and play? I'm like, you playing linebacker. The groin is what you need the most in terms of your shuffle. If you ain't got that, you don't have anything. And Miles is a fundamentally sound dude. But that, to me, was the reason why the Miles Jack signing turned out to how, how it did on the back end of it. But as you've heard us talk about Quan multiple times, what has been the common thing that we keep saying? He has to stay healthy. As long as he's healthy, we're going to be fine. If he can't stay healthy, then yeah. You might have some type of thoughts about Quan as well. But when these players are healthy, man, they're productive players. 